did not expect that. <laughs> Good morning, everybody. I'm pretending that this is the previous day whenever I from this vlog, but in actual fact, sorry, Byron, I just realized I'm doing this over your. Oh, that's all good. No, 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 sorry. I'm not actually in my own room. I'm in Byron's room right now. But more importantly, today is officially the first day of my attempt at Vlogmas this year. Run titles! It's Thatcher Joe's Vlogmas, but remember, he's not a daily vlogmas. <laughs> Now on a Sunday night I like to write out a list of what I'm going to get up to in the week and try and like tick off as many of these things as possible so I'm feeling productive. The first thing on my list for this week is to have breakfast. The thing is I've not been very good at um, having breakfast, especially coming back from LA like I said before I have the worst jet lag in the world and it's made through my stomach rather than my sleeping patterns. My sleeping pattern's fine, I can get over that, it's not too bad. I wake up like 3 in the morning really hungry and uh, wanting to eat when obviously you shouldn't eat when you, at that time of night and then throughout the day I'm just not really hungry. So this week I really need to try and concentrate on just getting some food inside me in the the mornings and breakfast is the most important meal of the day. What is called breakfast, break fast. You're breaking your fast because you fast throughout the night. Science, science. Education. You can't now tell me this is not an educational channel. I've just given you some knowledge. There you go. Keep that. Tell your friends at school. They'll be impressed. <laughs> they probably won't, will they? Anyway, let's get up, start the day. Let's not do my hair because I mean I'm only I'm only going down the road. But let's go and find Byron. Good morning, bro. Oh, you're already, we're already ready to go. You said breakfast, let's go. <laughs> you read my mind. Oh, I've just realised, I've just watched back that last clip and I had the biggest lump of sleepy dust. Oh, that's what I used to call it, anyway, sleepy dust. What do you call it? That stuff in your eyes? I call it gross, bro. Gross. Oh, bro, I've got gross in my eye. Sorry about that. We are now heading off somewhere for breakfast. Hopefully you can find somewhere really quick because it's freezing. Oh, I completely forgot to uh, vlog my breakfast in true fashion, but I didn't come across this guy. How's it going, Connor? You all right? I feel like on the flower. Can you see? <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> Back in the Sug residence and oh! I'm gonna have to put a blur on that. I've just realised that I'm wearing the Sug merch. People aren't supposed to know about this. You're supposed to be doing the old stuff, bro. See, Byron's got it right. It's all Halloween in my head. <laughs> so Byron, one of these days, see, remember I said in the previous vlog that I was going to try and kick the, one of the legs out? Yeah. With some Timberlands on and see if it collapses. Is that happening? I think we should try it. Should we try not it? No. <laughs> what do I sit on? <laughs> Good point. Maybe not now. In a future vlog. In a yeah. vlog further on in the future. <laughs> oh! <gasps> That reminds, speaking of chairs, that reminds me. Yeah. That's a good little segue, Byron. I like that. Well done. You have no idea what we just did, but that's actually a very, very valuable part of the vlog. Anytime you need a segue, you're on your man, bro. <laughs> Yesterday I was sat there thinking, do you know what? I feel like I just don't do enough for my friends. I feel like there's so much more I could do for them to support them and to basically try and make them as happy as possible. So basically, in a nutshell, I want to try, I want to try and self-improve, become a nicer person, and I want to make my friends' dreams come true. And to start with, I'm going to start with one of my friends who I feel like needs it most. That makes it sound really bad, doesn't it? <laughs> Mikey Pierce. Now, you may not know this, but Mikey is quite a keen astrologist slash astronaut slash he just loves anything to do with space. Cosmopolitan? No, that's a drink, isn't it? Mm, also a magazine. Or a, and a magazine, yeah. He's very, very keen about space. And one of Mikey's biggest dreams and aspirations is to actually go into space. So I've decided, being the nice guys that me and Byron are, we're gonna make Mikey's dreams come true today. But who makes his dream true of coming back to Earth? We didn't think that one through. That's a very good... Gonna, we're gonna get him to space, but then once he's up there... I mean, we can make part of the dream come true. Yeah, but he's gotta figure out the rest. Can't win the lottery for him and then tell him how to spend his money. Exactly, it. exactly. He's gotta do some of it himself. That's a very good point, Byron. Thank you, right? You're so wise. Yeah. So this is what we're gonna do. Ah, uh, yeah! Oh, that didn't work. Hey! Ah. Helium! Actually saying that, I put Mikey's dreams and aspirations on the hole for a bit because my house is an absolute turret! So I need to do a little bit of a spring clean. What do you call a spring clean if it's not in spring? Just a clean. Clean? clean. Alright, I'm just gonna do a clean. Okay, halfway through cleaning up and I found this. Um, I don't know if I ever showed this in a vlog before, so I'm gonna show it now, especially to Byron, because I don't think Byron's seen this yet either. Byron, this is for you. Ooh, you're on his knee if you didn't notice. <laughs> Oh, bro, this is actually sick. It's not from me. Yeah, it's good. It's a good plectrum. Flipping flimsy plectrums are no go. A Sug Life plectrum. I definitely read out her letter that came with it or the message that came with it. Yeah. There was nothing in the box. If there was, <laughs> I must have. I think I already read it there and then, and then mm. don't know where it's gone. Whoever you were, please make yourself known in the comments below, and I'll give you a shout out. I think you need to test it out. Please. There's a guitar. There. Oh yeah. This was called Thanks to the Plectrum. Got your name. So 
so I feel really bad. Thanks for the pleasure. Anything to add, Byron? It's times like these, I'm glad we record these songs so that we can use them in lyrics in our own songs later. That's a bit too long to fit into a song, but don't worry, because it's fine. Two! Hopefully that's enough to hold Mikey's weight. 200 balloons and two canisters of helium. Hopefully, I mean this is not floating. I've just had a really bad thought. What? So, we've got two canisters of balloons, right? Two canisters of helium. Yeah. I mean, this is not floating in the air. No, that's pretty it, heavy. I'm pretty sure Mikey weighs more than a can of helium. I'm pretty sure Mikey weighs more than this. Well, how much does Mikey wear? I don't know, he has been gymming a lot recently. He's been gymming a lot. This is definitely not gonna work but it is going to be funny. Maybe it's all about the balloons, I don't know, maybe it's when they're spread out into a balloon form. Yeah, you didn't take into account the weight of the balloons. Oh! Oh, Byron! It's working! Oh! <laughs> What's the best thing to do with helium, other than tying balloons? Uh, ooh. Hello, Mikey's going to be an astronaut today. Look at my facial hair. Donate link in the description for November. Link in the description. We're very close to our 300,000. 300,000? 3,000 pound goal, we can get it today guys, come on! <laughs> <laughs> the good thing is, we're not using our own oxygen. Change of the whole music industry completely. No one will see it coming. You never saw it coming. <laughs> okay, right. We've got quite a few here. I mean, I don't know if it's enough to lift Mike in the air, but keep going, Byron. You're doing a great job. You've got people like Richard Branson, who's like doing space expeditions. You've got people like Elon Musk, who are also doing. We're joining those ranks. Should you do the TED talk or should I? Um, I don't mind talking to a vlog, but in terms of like talking to people in suits and like people, people are gonna want to know about this now. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I know. But together, can you do TED talk? Is it always just one person for a TED talk, or is it two? I actually don't know. I think it's normally one, but hey. But then we're bending the rules. We've today we break the final frontier of going to space and TED talk. We have bending rules. Good point, Byron. Actually, no. Thinking about it, we're getting too carried away. This is not about us. We shouldn't be thinking about us doing a TED talk, Byron. This is about one person, and that's Mikey making his dreams come true of being a space cadet astronaut thing. I think he's most excited about the space food. of the uh, helium have you guys inhaled? Uh, quite a lot. Quick, get in the shot, you're wearing the, you're wearing the merch. I don't mind you being in my vlog when you're wearing the merch, Josh. Quick, get in. Tell them what you've been up to today. <laughs> Sag life. Uh, it's actually very, very comfortable. I think this is your best piece of merch yet. Oh, Josh! It's very comfortable. It's very comfy. Do you, um, you want to know where you can get it? Duglife.com. So we've got two types of chair. We've got this little one, this little green guy down here, or this garden chair right here. Similar sort of chair to what Byron edits on. Because if you use a lighter chair, there's more chance of him actually being able to go up, up in the air into space. You don't give a <laughs> shit. <laughs> that will hold Mikey, right? I can't even fit in between the, the, uh, the thing. You just gotta believe in yourself, Josh. I don't wanna break it. You just gotta believe in yourself. That's it. Oh, okay, right. Um. <laughs> Well, that is the end of today's vlog. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and I will see you, uh, well, never. I'm deleting my channel. F*** you, Josh! Luckily for you, you I'm a really, really good <laughs> vlogger, and I bought spares. Come on, Josh! Mike's on his way, I want to make sure that he's having the best, he has the best day of his life. We're going to send him space, for God's sake. We're making history on this channel. It's genuinely ready to go, look. I'm, I, I'm having to hold it down. And you're not very strong as well. I've exactly. Struggling. This is good. That's well, good to go. Look, ready? It's not gonna work, is it? You're lying to us back there where you said it was floating. Yeah. We've been sitting here helping tie balloons the whole morning, you just lied to us. No, don't worry, this one is floating. Yeah, that one is. Okay. This is fully, fully. Yeah, no, look, 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 floating. Screwed up massively. I guess in a way this kind of works out like a prank because we're gonna make it out of these chairs are actually floating. So Mikey Jimmy feels like it's gonna hopefully hold him in the air. And. Ooh, there he is. <laughs> yep, I'm gonna. Hell, mate. Yeah. Such a <laughs> Are you ready? 
I've met her with my coat on. We're going to send you into space. I'm, I'm excited. excited. I'm very excited. Ready. I'm very excited. I've got the big camera and all, Jay. <laughs> Boys, it's going. Oh! It's actually going. Oh! Thanks, mate, you can go home now. I feel bad. I really what? wanted to send you into space. I know. I mate. heard that you were really into space travel, right? I am. I love space. I who's, love your, space. who's your favourite astronaut? Uh, what's his name? Captain Underpants. <laughs> it's not Ron, it was the other one. It was the cute little person, to, to put a picture. You know, the one who actually was a farter. <laughs> I, I, Do you not remember that film? A NASA astronaut? No, he farted on his way to space and it put, to put him on space Thunderpants, the film Thunderpants. Oh, okay. That's a film. That's your, that's your favourite astronaut. Hey, what, what you got for me, buddy? What's your favourite planet? Mars. Chocolate bar. <laughs> I mean, oh, I can't show you this. Blur, blur. Yeah, this is not out yet. The maroon. But you can have you can have one of them. Um, we've got, what size are you? That's a large Christmas oh, jumper. Yeah, it's squeezing so large. Yeah, take Just that. Look at this. It's feeling so festive here. And modeling, Byron. Me, like it's just modeling the high and mighty. It's <laughs> ASOS bigger man. Yeah, ASOS plus size models. You're like a festive Tweedledum and Tweedled Tweedledee. You're all very loyal to me. Look, you're all repping the brand. You're looking great. It's no, like Joe, Josh. You, you just made us. But, huh? And you just forced us. No, you said you, you wanted some. I feel like nowadays you can't do your own vlog without having to then be in everyone else's vlogs. Yeah. Slash videos, yeah. slash. I'm gonna do this because you're wearing my merch. Also, Byron, yeah. what's with this? The hula yeah. hoop on your floor. That's always been there. I was gonna ask you about that at some stage. I thought it was you had some sort of weird hobby. Oh, you like to Byron do. Hula hoop. <laughs> Imagine Byron is there coming down, knocking on the door. I'm like, wait, Byron's making some weird noises downstairs. <laughs> like, some like grunting. I come in, you're just there hula hooping on your bed. <laughs> Suspense is killing me. Byron! Byron! <laughs> <laughs> Was it worth the wait, bro? It was worth the wait. <laughs> I was thinking so hard, I was thinking, what can I, what can I say? What can I do? <laughs> Byron, what are you saying for dinner? Waggers. Oh, wagger mummers. All right, but fine, 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 fine. Also, update on the uh, facial hair. I don't know if you can see. Look at the color of my eyebrows, right? Then look at the color of this. It's not the same color. Borderline, strawberry, bl <sighs> it's ginger. All the times. I've ever taken the mick out of Josh, I've now got to take it all back. Deep down, I am Josh. Deep down, I am Josh. Why couldn't I have taken his height? You have a little stargaze there, Byron. Yeah, it's like a little eclipse. Byron, I've told you so many times, that's not the sun. It's a light bulb. There are four suns in this room. No, they're, they're lights. Joe, can you just let the poetic justice be? This is the band music making room. <laughs> there are four suns. Actually saying that, as you may have saw earlier on the vlog, we were with Connor. We're going to see him a bit later on for dinner, hopefully, to, for the, little, the old cheeky little wagamama. But also, he's actually hanging out with us and potentially making some music, which is going to be fun. We're still waiting for Connor. Once again, guys, Maynard minutes. They say 15 minutes. It's never 15 minutes. You times that by at least two, Byron. In the meantime, Byron and I are gonna play, I think it could be our favorite game at the moment. We haven't played it, we haven't played it sober yet, but this could be our new favorite game. I played it before with Ollie quite a lot. Um, Rocket League, the game where you play as cars and you drive and hit the ball into the, the, the net at the other end of the thing. Obviously, what's up with this music? It's been a baby roll that I want. We thought whilst you wait for Connor, we're gonna set up a game and play it online. But I guarantee you, as soon as I turn that projector on, this thing right here is gonna go off for the picture of Connor Maynard's giant face just there, staring down the lens. Right, Byron, let's do this. Let's do this, bro. Oh! Oh my god! No! Bloody hell, Connor! Well, Byron, no Rocket League. Until we get back. <laughs> <laughs> 
I've walked into a wall. Here he is, the late come over. As you're late, <laughs> you've got to do a shot out of the leg chair that Mikey broke today. Ah, oh, this bit. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you ever done a shot out of a table leg, uh, chair leg before? Never, I'm a oh. never. never met one. Here it comes, say when. <laughs> oh my god, no. He's done it. Oh, I don't know how to get down. Yeah, yeah. Get up, just leave it. Oh my god, man, the tips. Let's get it. Oh my god. Oh, pinch me knob. Tell you what, boys. This is the first Christmas song I've heard on radio. This is me? Yeah, Connor, why did you never release a Christmas song? Or did you? If so, I'm a bad fan, I'm a fake fan. I'm um, not a virgin. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you hear that, Bieber? <laughs> and you, Buble. I know what you're like. He's frigid. <laughs> Frigid he is. Food shop. Oh, 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 lovely. Mm, yes, oh, yeah, lovely. Oh, uh. oh, thank you very much, Rocky Mama. You're amazing and I love you. And thanks so much. You had a wonderful meal. Byron, how's your meal? Oh, short rib ramen oh, for the win. Oh, ramen. Time. Short rib short rib ramen for short Byron. Rib. What do you have, Connor? I got the chicken katsu. With extra sauce. Extra sauce. And I had something else. I haven't pointed out we're all wearing. Boom. We can't show this yet. Boom. Secret. Let's put a giant blur across that. It's that time again. Now proceed to the racetrack. Where are you? Hello? Yes! There we go. Joe Zoella's brother. Point blank, I used to have this game on PS2, right? Classic. It came free with Tekken 2. I'm so bad, it's a maths one. Post game interviews, Joe, how do you think you win? How was your shooting tonight? I mean, I I did better than, even though Connor beat me in the uh, the uh, racing. You kept me in the game with this one. I did better him, I would have died. I do feel I like did if, die, if we were in a war, I would literally know my role. I'd be quite good. Yeah, I think quite I good. would like, I don't know what I would do. I think I'd probably wait for like the dust to settle and then after that I would just be a breeder. <laughs> to get the population back up to what it was before. In real life you can't... In real life you can't put the pound coin in and start again. Joe, you're probably going to hate me for this, but this is a long clip of absolutely nothing. Absolutely nothing happens. Yeah, look at you pointing away. You're not going to put this in the video, are you, bro? No way, no chance. Are we ready, team? I'm clearly the best. I'm so bad, but you're not playing. It's fine, bro. That's all good, Joe. So when you watch this back. I'm so when you watch this back, you'll realize what I'm actually doing. I'm having the most fun. Come back, we've got one balloon, road balloon in the way right now. For sake. What's it doing? What's it doing? What are you doing, balloon? Man, it's funny, it's funny, bro. It's funny. It's my way, it's jealous. It's <laughs> jealous of the attention. <laughs> so, there we go. I hope you enjoyed this vlog. If you did, give it a thumbs up, subscribe so you don't miss a future vlog, and I will see you tomorrow with day two of Thatcher Joe's Vlogmas. Bye. And I'm not a daily vlogmaser.